Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily vibes for the 15th and the 16th, so Saturday to Sunday. Um, this is for whoever it resonates with. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid, okay? This may not have happened yet. It may not even be for you. Don't try to make it fit. So I cut this deck before I started, and it appears that somebody is trying to find the courage, or they have found the courage, or you know they're they're willing to walk away from something. Finding the courage to walk away. Okay, There's somebody's walking away. I'm walking away. I I I don't need to fight this battle. I don't need to fight with you. You win. You win. You deal with it. It's yours not mine. I don't need it. Let me just turn that off. There we go. So yeah, somebody has decided to retreat. I'm done. I'm done. I, I don't not I don't need to. So, you know, you could be what you could be the one watching somebody walk away, you know? Maybe maybe you are watching somebody walk right out of your life. Maybe you're just letting them go. You know, you're just letting them go because they don't want to put in any effort. That could be the case. It appears that you have have taken the time to, or you're taking the time to, to go within to figure out what path you need to take. Where do I need to go? What do I need to do? What opportunity is going to be the best for me? And it feels as though you you are probably just going within. I need time. I need time to think about this. I need time to. be alone. I just want to be alone. You know, I'd rather be alone at this point. That's what I see. This one's walking away by himself. This is a, this is alone and this is alone. So it feels like I just need to be alone. I need to be alone at this time. I, I can't, I can't do this anymore. You may cut somebody out. You may decide to cut somebody out of your life uh, very quickly. There's a lot of hurt. There's some hurt here. It's like, why did you do this? Why? Why? Our, our love, the feelings that I had for you are, are gone. They're gone. I don't have any more feelings left for you. It feels as though somebody is deciding to making a decision as to where to go next. Where do I, where do I go next? Now that I know that you don't care, all you want to do is argue, all you want to do is win. Judgment. 
wake up call, an awakening. Somebody has, has decided or heard the truth. I know the truth. And it feels like now you have probably became cold, frozen. I see. I see what this is. I do. I see what this is. It's gone. It's gone. The love is gone. It's not even, there's nothing left. And I, and I accept, I accept the truth. And now I'm withdrawing from the situation completely, completely. There's no need to communicate with me because I can't hear you. I can't see you. I'm turning my back on this situation completely. No. I've been denying it for too long. Somebody has been in a state of denial, avoiding the truth for too long. And now they have decided to shut down completely. Complete shutdown. Emotional withdrawal. There's been no communication. Somebody has been lying to themselves. And they have kept going back, been kept, they've been going back to what was, but it's already gone. It's already dried up. It's done. It's dried up. And now I see, now I see the light. This time alone that you forced upon me has enlightened me. It's woken me up. And now there's no love left. There's no love left. There's been a lot of worries. There may be some regrets. But it's time to close this chapter. It's time to close this door. Wonderful. So let me just make sure this is focused. For those of you that are going to ask, this is the vice versa deck. Okay, there's stuff on both sides. Somebody has been in denial, but through their loneliness, through their time of introspection, through their time of despair they have come to the conclusion that there's another opportunity for me because the person that they were invested in would not communicate would not open up and continuously had to prove a point that wasn't worth proving. So now there's a new offer coming in or around the corner. There's a new offer waiting. Okay, there is. There's an offer of love waiting. And it feels as though somebody is about to
turn around and walk away. You know, this is the sword of truth and this is the card of truth. These are both awakenings. Wake up call. I'm awake. I'm awake. I, I see. I see what this is. I'm seeing this situation absolutely clearly. After being in denial for so long. So somebody is, is definitely turning their back on a situation and it's gone it's gone cold, okay? It's gone completely cold. The love that we once had is is no more. There's no need for me to look back. There's no need for me to look at you. There's no need for me to even pretend that this will ever work out. It's time to let go of this worry and this despair and stop focusing on the loss and grab the new opportunity. So there is a new opportunity here for those of you that have, have awoken and released and turned your back on a situation that was a no-win situation. No win. You cannot win with this person. If you are the one that has truly walked away and has awoken, there's a new opportunity. There is. There's a new opportunity. There's an offer that is valid and genuine. It's like the truth is being accepted. I accept. I accept. I accept, period. I accept the truth. And I accept the new. I'm turning my back on this situation that has caused me so much despair and worry. It's time for me to take that blindfold off, unblock my heart. And make the decision to be free. It's time for me to face my fears and stop protecting myself because of what you did to me. I've avoided this awareness for too long. But now I'm awake. Now I'm awake. Wide awake. I see it. I see it clearly. And now and now it's time for me to truly see this through the new perspective that it is and offer my love elsewhere. So I feel like, you know, I have to tell you guys that these readings have been, you know, going out for me. They haven't been happening like on this day. It's been a few days out, so just keep that in mind. Um, for some of you, there's, there's been an awakening. There's been an awakening and a release. Okay? It's a release. Um, somebody has found their power. This is the sword of power. It's the sword of truth. If, I mean, I, I, I'm taking back my power. The power is in my hands. I have the power. I see the truth. It's time to release and forgive. And focus on the future. I 
I realize, I realize that the future is so much brighter than what's behind me. I realize that. Queen of Pentacles, basically reversed. Turn the, look at look at this. Okay, we have the Queen of Pentacles reversed, the Queen of Swords reversed, the Queen of Cups reversed. There is a woman that is turning her back once and for all. Looking at a new opportunity. I've given it my all. I would have died. I would have died for you. I mean, the Queen of Pentacles is somebody that will give it all. In reverse, I mean... But now my back is turned to stone. I've turned to stone, to stone cold to this situation. There's no more giving. I have nothing left to give. So it feels like somebody has decided to really, really wake up. And face the music, face the storm, face the shadow side. This is a star. You know, this rain is going to wash away what doesn't serve you. You are being protected. Whatever this was that you were, you still had that hope in, that last glimmer of hope, you know. Whatever it is, whatever that was. It didn't work out because you were being protected. This is a card of protection. And there's an opportunity of love that is coming towards you. Wish fulfillment is around the corner. Somebody's been watching and waiting for the right time. I feel like you may receive some communication from whoever this person is that has been waiting. Waiting for you to wake up. Waiting for you to stop looking at the loss that you have been focused on. So I feel for some of you, you have been focused on a loss. You've been going through a period of perhaps introspection, which was needed to heal. And, and somebody has been watching and waiting for the divine time to come in and make their offer. Now, it could have been the universe waiting for that divine time. It could have been the universe waiting for you to wake up. Because you have to do your work. You have to do your, your, your work to become aware of what is. You have to be ready to wake up. You have to make that choice to wake up. You have to make that choice to truly walk away. And turn your back on a situation that is unworthy of your attention. So I feel like you, you, something that you have been waiting for and hoping for and praying for. 
even subconsciously, is coming around. I feel like this it's coming around at this time because you have taken the time to release, to turn your back on a situation that doesn't serve you, you know. There's no need. There's no need for me to fight for this if I if we can't compromise. If you don't talk to me, if if it you can't even communicate. So, I, I, you know, there's been a lack of communication over here in this situation and somebody was trying to prove a point, trying to prove and if you can't compromise, then I don't need to be involved. So anyway, I feel like there's, there's an opportunity. Somebody has decided to focus on the future. I'm only focusing on the future. I'm turning my back on the past. I am. I'm turning my back on this despair. I'm turning my back on this worry. I'm turning my back on this guilt, these guilty feelings that I've been holding on to. Because my future looks bright. It does. So I feel like there is a, a new offer coming in. It's been waiting. And, and now that you have awoken and you're accepting the truth, you're seeing the situation clearly, this, there's, there's like a wish that you have been wishing for, that it, a, wishing, a wish of love is coming. It's coming. It's coming together. There's definitely a woman that is turning her back. Absolutely. And looking at a new man. Look, there's a woman that is deciding to look at a new man. Deciding to accept a new man. There is. I mean, that's what I see. And maybe you are going to help each other heal this new person. You and this new person are going to help each other heal because this person needs healing as well. This person is looking at you. Okay, so there's a, there's a, there's a man, there's a man that is watching you evolve, watching you heal. And I think that this man is going to come in with some communication and an offer to help an offer of love an offer of emotional support so I feel like there is there's two people that are looking at each other there is there is you're there's a woman that's looking at a man and a man that's looking at a woman thinking this is my wish fulfillment this is what I want this man is saying you know I see I see that this is this is my dream come true. This is what I want. There could be a man that is wanting a reconciliation. And is going to come clean with the truth. I just have to tell you that because this man is looking at wish fulfillment. This could be a reconciliation is coming with the truth. An offer. So for some of you, that could be the case. But, I also see that there is a woman, there's definitely a woman that is looking at a new offer. Or is considering making a new offer. Or accepting an offer from a man. So it could go either way, but I do believe that there is somebody who has turned their back on a situation that was a constant battle, a constant, constant, constant battle. And they'd been staying in denial for way, 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 way too long. And now, now it's like, you know, I'm only going to focus on the future. I'm turning my back. I'm turning my back on this despair. Uh, I don't really need it. I don't. So I do feel like there is a man that is, is probably going after his dream. And there could be a woman that accepts. 
So I don't know who this is for. Somebody has this is has woken up. They've woken up. I'm awake. Let's get a couple more cards. I'm withdrawing. I'm withdrawing. I've withdrawn from the from the past. Totally withdrawn. This time of introspection and, and uh, being alone has served me very well. It has. The love that we had has grown cold. And now I'm focused on something new. Somebody could be coming to you with the truth. Somebody, I mean, it looks like the truth is about to be revealed in some situation. But I think that there is going to be a man that is going to reveal the truth. And this could be somebody brand new. Could be a reconciliation. Whatever it is, it's... Uh, It could lead to love. Okay, it could lead to love, whatever it is with that. I think somebody's coming in with an offer of love. They've been waiting, you know, for the right time, and the time is probably now. Flirt. Extend your lighthearted energy to others. Worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life, and like I said, the time is now. Somebody has been waiting for the perfect time, and I feel like the time is now. They've seen that you've done your work. They see that you've truly turned your back. You've truly turned your back on the situation that was hurting you. You've dealt with it. You've faced, the, you've faced it. You've dealt with it. You're no longer in denial. They see that you're focused, you're prepared, you're ready. And so now, what you've been waiting for is coming. That's what I see. I feel like somebody has, has made a huge release. They've reopened up the gates. And now there's a, there's a, a new opportunity. And I think that there's somebody has been watching and waiting for the perfect time. And the perfect time is now for the truth to come out. Something is about to be revealed. There's going to be a revelation. Somebody is going to reveal how they truly feel. That's what it looks like to me. And I think it's, you know, I really feel like, I don't know. It could be, it could be somebody from the past or it could be, it could be somebody new. But I know that there's somebody in this mix that doesn't have good intentions. So be careful. If you truly think that your past has changed, okay, this guy has to win. He has to win. He's got something to prove. And if you had to walk away from him before, what makes you think that they've changed? What makes you think that, you know, they're coming to you with the truth? I mean, maybe maybe you just maybe you left them with with too much responsibility or you left them with all the burden and now they can't handle it and they've woken up. I mean, that could be the case. I highly doubt it. I highly doubt it. I feel like this person that you have walked away from, their ego is too big to come around. But it's not to say it couldn't happen. It could happen. Somebody is about to go after their wish fulfillment because they see that you have turned your back on one situation. Either you've turned your back on them completely and they see it now and they're like, you know what, I can't let this go. 
It's gone. I can see that it's gone. This person that walked away from me has lost all feeling. So that could be the case. This person, this person could be the one that sees that you have gone stone cold and they're like, oh, fuck. Excuse my language. She's gone. Now I'm going to have to do something about it because I don't want to let this dream die. And so now they're coming in with an offer, perhaps even an apology. But, like I said, we have this huge ego up here. For somebody that has a huge ego to that point, getting an apology is... People that have a huge ego cannot apologize. Okay? So, don't get your hopes up. This may not be for you. Somebody is going after their wish fulfillment because it's it's hit the point of no return and now they're like you know I already said it this is this is my future is slipping away okay my future is slipping away it's it's it is my wish fulfillment my happiness is slipping away steady progress we acknowledge you for the progress you made in remembering love in your daily activities we can clearly see the contribution you're making in the world through your thoughts, feelings, and actions of love. So, you know, this is saying that somebody has made progress to heal, basically. Made progress to move forward. Made progress to let go of denial and reopen, reopen their heart. <clears throat> So I feel like there's somebody has, has awoken from their sleep. And regaining the power that's been lost. Talk to you next time.